Hi everyone, welcome back to XCOM, and um, we're gonna actually do something that I forgot to do like two episodes ago. Uh, we have major bulletins open, but I don't know why I can't make any of these people majors. Kind of weird. Oh, because they need to be captains, I think. Alright, so I'm gonna make these two people captains, so. Uh, members uh, of your squad within 12 t tiles get an additional da uh, point of damage reduction when cover will not on the snipers, so I'd rather do that one. Yeah, oh great, we gotta wait for this every time. Fuck. Yeah, okay, salute. Salute right now. Alright. Uh, so there's that. Oh, we have more fucking captain bullet bullets up? Fuck. Um, wait, you're wounded? Or... No, you're not. Okay, she's still on a mission. Alright. Yeah, same thing. I, I forgot, like, it adds fatigue or something. Which would be awful. Basically, I can't give them the, the bonuses that are within, like, close range because, like, it's useless then. Uh, okay. And apparently these people cannot get... Well, I can't... I can't promote people to major, though. Which is kind of weird. I don't know why. Um... Maybe they have to do more missions before they can get the, the next upgrade. Because that one's an experience upgrade, and I would rather, I'd like to have that one. Yeah, I can't give them it. So there's some reason why I can't. I don't know. I'll figure that out later, I guess. Um, so, yeah. We got defense bonuses, which are really going to do us well on this mission. I'll tell you that much. Excellent. We look forward to seeing your progress. All right, here's what we got. Uh, welcome to the team, Dejangologist. Um, you're going on a very tough mission, I'm not going to lie. But I'm sure you'll have a blast. Uh, we got our, our sniper here. Uh, we got a uh, 69th bullet here to, to manage Overwatch. Uh, we got our assault here to do assault-related items. Our rocketeer uh, for emergency situations. Uh, our engineer for more emergency situ situations. I'm sure there'll be a lot of them. Uh, our gunner is here as well. Actually, we actually have a shadow ray with him. I'm gonna bring a la laser laser gun with him. Our Daryl Dixon is our Overwatch gunner. Uh, the only person with a med kit. I don't think we'll be needing it to be honest. Uh, but you never know. So that's what she's here for. And Van Dorn is coming along. I don't have any other weapons to give him at all. Like literally nothing. So whatever. Let's see how it goes. This is a good experimental mission for, I guess, the to see how effective mech suits are. Prepare for deployment, strike one. It had to happen at some point, though. The drop site for this operation will be in Canada. Yeah, Canada. And that's all we get. Holy shit! He just fucking jumps off. Doesn't give a shit. He's bald as fuck, though. Alright, so, he counts as, like, one thing. Wow, he's got a lot of HP, look at that. Well, he is supposposed to tank for me, so there's that. Alright, so, one for all. Let's see what that does. He becomes high cover until he moves again or uses an arm-based weapon. So what? what is he right now? Is he cover right now? No, he has to, he has to use that ability, so. Oh, neat. I could just I could take cover on him. <laughs> That's awesome, actually. I wonder if we can get hurt. Oh, anyways. Okay, that's kind of that's that's the kind of need ability. I'm not gonna lie. All right, where's my gunner? My gunner needs to be in uh, over here. All right, so so if you I've done this mission several times. This is like I think well my third my third time doing it. Every fucking time, every time you ta play XCOM, it seems that you're forced to do this, but I don't know. I'm, I'm not, I'm, I'll leave it as a surprise for you. Basically, seagulls are invading uh, New Brunswick or wherever the fuck this is. Oh no, St. John's. Same thing as New Brunswick. But, but yeah, so we're in the Maritimes right now. And you, you hear those seagulls right now? They're fucking awful. They have a major seagull problem over in, over in, uh, over there. So XCOM has been called in to basically... Because they poop, like they poop everywhere. So, all right, let's move him up. All right, there's nobody there. Let's go. Just bring my sniper over here. 
gunner can go right here, or maybe Let's right here, do actually. This. Uh, the, the idea is though that for every for every run that my my these guys go up, um, like I, I want the I want the the LMG -er to basically Location cover them, confirmed. like one time essentially. And I just it just occurred to me I did not give her fire control. Fuck. All right, I'm at it again. All I changed was. Um, well, You've I should. Oh. Near your position, strike one, which means the chrysalids aren't far behind. We need to find out where these things are coming from on the double. New objective received. All right. Well, this is interesting. Well, go shoot that motherfucker. So the nice thing is, she shoots, and now she's Overwatch. Yeah. Um. Yeah, so I just gave her the fire control thing. Uh, it basically removes the aim penalty on Overwatch, and that's it. Alright, I'm gonna make this per person just snipe that guy. And now this is where I figure I get some rookie promotions, so... Um, hey, D Dejangoologist, do you want to fucking beg your, beg your first chrysalid of the day? No, trust me, it's easy, don't worry. Just go right up to them and shoot them. It's okay. Now be very careful with your aim. I know it's 62%, but I'm sure you can get it. Yeah, level up for you. Good job. All right. Um, we're gonna just move this guy over here in Overwatch. And this is my engineer. Engineer's gonna do engineer-related things. Oh, fuck me. Fuck me sideways. Fuck me sideways and a half. All right, that's not good. That one fucking tile. Where's my rocketeer? Ah, oh, that's you. Okay, good. All right. Where are you aiming? Where are you aiming? You fucking idiot! Oh my god. God fucking damn it! I hate rocketeers so much. Well, I'll go fucking grenade them then. Instead. I don't think they're gonna be able to come close enough to do anything, though. Or maybe they will. Oh, we're dead. What else do we have? We have, uh... The ability to assault some things. Uh, he's got close encounters, though, so there's that. Um... We're just gonna shoot this guy with the mech. Holy shit, that gun looks awesome. Alright. Oh my god, is he gonna do that every fucking time, even though he's a mech? Alright, just shoot that guy. Alright, we've got close encounters, I think this will be okay. Because they can jump up here, but I think they're gonna- it's gonna require them to do a lot more than that. Yeah, okay, the zombies have to move twice, so we're- we're okay for the zombies. Zombies was not something that was my concern before. It's actually the guys that k just came up. Hey, look at this. This is the, um... That's his little thing that prevents them from aiming at him. That's awesome. I already like this guy, actually. He's actually kind of cool. Alright, what are you gonna do? Oh yeah, he, yeah, he can't make it up here. And right, here we go, close combat specialist. Yeah, that's what I thought that he would be good for. Okay, and that means they can't make it up here in one move. Good job. There we go. We saved it, fellas. You got two chrysalids. You're good. All right. And for some reason, that blew up. Right. Now, let's not have a repeat of what we just did there. Heading to that location. Gonna move back for a second. Mechs are pretty awesome, though. Alright, let's go get this guy. 14 damage, holy shit. That's Five awesome. Rounds. Oh, he's out of ammo already, though? Okay, so he's he's a powerful beast, but requires a little bit of a setup, I guess. Alright, Django. I think I want to give this one to you, but I don't know. I don't know if you've deserved it. Okay, I'd rather give it to, as I said, the rookie again. 
The rookie's gonna... Well, yeah, the rookie's gonna be real happy this mission. Uh, let's have a look. Rocketeer can have maybe the second one. This is this is actually one of my lesser Rocketeers as well. Alright. Alright, we're good now. I'm pretty happy with how that went. So yeah, so there's chrysalids and zombies all over this fucking map. And I'm actually I'm kind of sold on the on the mechs now. I think they looked at like the shivs and went like, how can we improve the shivs? And then they made the mechs. Because th th that's the thing that the the shivs really lack was like the the progression of some sort of like some sort of meaningful progression throughout the game and things like that, you know. All right, we're gonna reload him. Uh, this guy can probably move up to like, I don't know, actually nowhere. Let's go reload everyone. There's no reason for me not to. Oh, there's someone over there. I suppose this is what the mech is for. The mech actually makes a really good scout. Like, he's got so much fucking HP. And he even has a damage reduction bonus. Holy shit, mechs kick ass. He's got a lot of damage, too. I'm gonna have, like, two mechs, I think, like, dedicated on, the, on, these, on this team. Question is, what kind of mech should I get? Ah, uh, so it's just a zombie. How boring. Alright. Uh, I think what we're gonna do is Rookie's gonna go over here for a shot. Oh, there's, there's two zombies. I'm not really concerned about that, to be honest. <laughs> nice, you broke her cover. What a fucking asshole. We're like playing pranks on the rookie. It's like, haha, your cover's gone. Ah, uh, rookie didn't get that one. Well, let's give it to the our engineer instead. The engineer I'm okay with with her leveling up to. Or him. Uh, let's see. Aha, I won't go down without a fight. Alright, Sniper... Sniper can just kind of stay there right now. I'm gonna move the, the, this person there, though. Uh, just aim. I'm watching! I'm watching. God, Van Dorn is so fucking annoying, though. But we'll keep we'll keep him around. I just... Uh, whatever. I'm gonna get annoyed every time, just know that. Where's it going? Alright, let's see how he overwatches. God damn it, you're the worst. Yeah, it's like a fucking huge minigun too. I hear they can have rail guns, by the way. Ah, oh, at least the shotgunner got him somewhat. By the way, my objective here somewhat is to get like a lot of levels on these people. Uh, and I think no, there's nothing there. Oh, it's a zombie. Alright. Well, you know what? I'm gonna just move this person over here. Wow, he can actually he can also move really far. Let's have a look at what, what we see. I'm no fisherman, but something about that shark just doesn't look right. I really like that bonus he gets, by the way. Alright, 12 damage. Oh, you're out! It just runs out of ammo like instantly. Holy shit! That's that is the one flaw I can see of these guys, if anything. Solid copy. Let me go shatter right the fuck out of the other guy. And you missed. All right. Weapons empty. Can't engage. Just excites. Uh, I don't know. You can, rookie can try and take it again. Rookie's got it. I mean, that's what they did with Long Wars. They made, like, the, the ammunition actually matter in a lot of cases, so I, I can't say I'm surprised. Alright, let's, let's do our best not to actually activate anybody. Oh, we just activated people.
Lightning reflexes. Damn it. He's got no ammo though. That's the problem. But we're gonna we're gonna just chuck a grenade and probably a rocket in their direction. I mean, there's a lot of them, so. Well, that's new. We should probably let Doctor Valen know about this. I doubt one chrysalid and a shark was enough for them to overrun this town, though. Keep an eye out for anything else the chrysalids might be nesting in. Alright. Just reload him. Fire a rocket at this. This is our last rocket though, unfortunately. But I think in this in this case we're running out of ammo for a lot of these guys, so it's actually probably a better idea that we do this. We could also chuck a grenade in. Probably that rookie's grenade. There we go. Uh, the real question is, I, I think I'm gonna make my gunner shoot some of them. We can also get the one back there. Let me see what else we got. Oh, well, my sniper hasn't shot anything yet. Actually, just shoot the one down there. Fuck that one. Ah, oh, well, okay. I mean, it's not the immediate threat, but whatever. Alright, well, he's got no ammo, but he can definitely do something with, like, uh, I don't know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move this guy over here and reload him, just so he can use his little close encounters thing. Let's see, what else do we have? Uh, well, he can take two shots. Yeah, I'm too worried about, I'm gonna make him grenade the rest of them. There's one of them has lightning reflexes, I know that much. So, I'll just grenade the fuck out of them. This is why we brought all these grenades, you know. Grenaders are amazing. I'm about to start keeping score. Executioner. And Overwatch is automatically I really like that. I really like this. This this kind of setup. Alright, and Alright, just, you know, overwatching everyone. Oh, there's definitely something up there. I liked having my mech go, go up first, you know. Also, yes, there's there's chrysalids in the sharks. You, ca you can't make this shit up. Or maybe you can. Uh, and we got... We got this motherfucker right here. Oh, oh, let's see his overwatch. Ah, yes. That's amazing. I should get this guy some moles, too. I mean, he's he's set up to be a defensive one, actually. Like, his, his, his entire loadout is basically, like, um, being as defensive as humanly possible. Yet, yeah, he does a really good job. He... Oh. That ship didn't just run aground. It looks like it was overrun. I'd say that's the likely source of our chrysalid problem. I guess we should just be thankful it wasn't a cruise liner. Alright, uh, let's go. I'm gonna actually move my sniper up, most likely. I'm on my way. So, yeah, we, as you can tell with this mission, we really don't need to bring in anybody, like... We, we get enough as it is in terms of, um, Time to motor. what is it called? Uh, we, we get enough bonuses as it is. Uh, well, we, we don't, we don't need cover, basically. That's what I was going to say. We get enough bonuses. I don't know what the fuck I was talking about. Alright, there's probably another zombie up here or something. By the way, there's something I really want to try here in, in a second. It's going to be amazing. Potentially. Moving out. All right. Um, I suppose we'll just kind of go over here. Yeah, we don't actually see anybody. We're just gonna have on cover. Where's my sniper? Okay, I want the sniper actually to go on top of this roof here. Because this is actually a pretty good place for the sniper to basically cover. With that damn good ground bonus, that's uh, amazing, actually. 
And you don't see anybody. All right. The gunner, however, will, I think, stay back here. Probably exactly right here. Because we, as, we don't need we don't need cover this mission. We really don't. This is not famous last words. We, we literally don't. Position confirmed. That's actually probably what makes the mech so fucking powerful here. Uh, some over there, but that should be super easy. There right, they are. Lightning reflexes. Well, Rocketeer doesn't have any ability. Fuck. I fucking hate Rocket. Like. Sorry, no, I, I fucking hate lightning reflexes so much when it's not on me. It's awful. Alright. Where's my, this person? Alright, let's see. Uh, you're gonna shoot the one in the back there. And now you're gonna overwatch. I like how she like says like, like as if I ordered her to do it, which when I really didn't. Good thing I had my sniper up here. Alright, uh, so we have a laser shatter ray. Some other bullshit here. Alright, so, uh, my... I'm gonna actually make this guy just jump down, jump on down here and kill this guy. I mean, he's got... he's also got the close, like, close combat stuff, so... 10% chance to crit, alright! Uh, that's not very good, but that's fine. I don't know why you had such a low chance to crit, but, you know... I, I won't judge you for it. What am I saying? Of course I will. Alright, where, where's our rookie? Rookie. Guess who gets to kill another Crystal today? This is a perfect mission for rookies. Look at this. Look at the, oh, it's like, oh, it's 89. Look at that. Oh, shit, yeah. I probably should give them the honorary XCOM hats. But they don't, they, they only earn that after, like, one mission, you know. That's how it works. If you, if you survive, you get your honorary XCOM fedora. Alright. And we totally fucked this kid up. Resupply requested. And we're just gonna shoot him with our uh, infantry. He's down. And Overwatch. Uh, probably just gonna reload just because we may need it. Oh, hey, look, another guy. Nope. The. Having having a lot of uh, sight there hasn't really done much for him. We're just gonna move my shotgunner over here. Back online. Whatever we can shoot him from here. I'm not activating anyone else at this point, so I'm just gonna do mostly reloads. That's the plan. I'm ready. Might as well reload literally everybody. So he's probably probably just gonna run straight into our Overwatch. Alright. I do like this mission though, it's kinda fun. With all the chrysalids. Poor St. John's though. Oh, apparently we can't, uh, we can't get him. Oh, try and crit him. Yeah. Alright, well, uh, let's go move this guy in here. I'm gonna try something though first. Can't wait. You see how there's a second floor here? Question becomes... On the move. If I go here, would, I, would it allow me to grapple? It, it doesn't look like it will. Oh well. Roger. I've got my eyes on. Alright. So, uh, we're, by the way, we're not going in there with everybody. It's just my assault that's going in there. So, what we do is we just kind of run up here. I'd say we found the source of our infestation, but this is worse than we could have imagined. If the chrysalids are using that whale as some sort of hive, who knows how many offspring they could produce? It's a whale of a good time. 
Strike one. Our sensor readings are picking up a whole lot of activity from inside the hold of that ship. I think you're about to have a lot of company headed your way. But nothing you've got on hand is going to be enough for this one. What we need is an airstrike. If you can reactivate that ship's transponder, we can have air support pinpoint your location and take the whole thing out. We have a new objective. I was curious to know if I could actually do that with, um... Uh... Well, just like... I was curious if I could do that with, uh, and, and grapple up there, you know, but I can't. So the reason why we have the assault is because the assault can just t fucking dash up there and defend himself with, uh, various, various means. Also, I'm not really su sustaining a good, f solid FPS right now. This place is really laggy for some reason. I guess it's all the fire effects and all that. Okay, so he's now moving back here, and, okay, so he's pacing back and forth, anticipation, yes, I know, there's a lot of whales. Orders confirmed. Moving out. We're going over there. So, because of the fact he can just shoot people with his shock and all that kind of shit, that's why I kind of used him for that. Ah, there he is, now he's coming out. Go get him, Van Dorm. You piece of shit AI that or guy that keeps talking to me all the time. So basically, my my all my gentlemen there are just there to basically cover him while he cover my assault while I uh, just activate this guy. There you Position go. Confirmed. Ship's transponder is active and transmitting. You need to get moving, Strike One. That whole place is going up in a matter of minutes, and anyone left behind is as good as dead. Yeah, we're objectives updated. We gotta basically get the fuck out. Uh, let's see. Actually, did, did, can we squad sight that guy or no? No, we can't. All right, so we're just gonna use a second move here right. to sprint away because now we need got eight turns to get back. So, oh, sniper does have a shot. There we go. Uh, actually, he's already been shot somewhat, so... Let's, let's give this one to our gunner, because the gunner will just overwatch anyways after she fires. He's down. God damn. Situations like this, I'm like, I gotta upgrade my computer. Now. Alright, so we're, we're staying up there, basically just to... Because once I get down here, I'm in chrysalid territory again, so... Uh, well, you can just kind of head up here and reload, actually. We're about- we're about to run. He's got two shots of that, it looks like, actually. Interestingly enough. They're all inside, FYI, so... There we go. We're gonna overwatch the fuck out of this guy. He's gonna get overwatched so hard. Oh no, whale. I hate whales. Yeah, so they're they're all now they're just flooding out now. Alright. So we're just gonna go around this corner with the assault. Hello! And goodbye, sir. Alright, we can't really get a shot with anybody, but except for this guy right here, but I'd rather move him back here. Fuck, where's my this guy? Okay, there he is. Heading out. Gonna move him here. Overwatch. My gunner will simply just overwatch. Our sniper will overwatch. We basically just we have to cover each other on the way out, you know. Can't wait to get out of this 30 FPS area. I'm wondering if I should even overwatch with this guy. It's probably not necessary, because he uses the ammo, but then again, I don't know, I'll do it anyways. Alright. So Assault is down there, but he's got like more than enough people covering him, and they can't get him in one move anyway, so... That's a really nice thing about the Assault. I probably actually should have moved my sniper and my gunner back, because they actually have the squad sight abilities. 
Oh, here we go. There's one. Alright. We're pulling out, so let's start moving back. Got it, moving. There's my sniper. The sniper and the gunner are the slowest moving. ones, but they also have the most range. So, there's like a bunch of advantages and disadvantages to the way I'm doing this right now. So it's just, it's just essentially, can I save enough overwatches, you know, as I'm moving back. And this guy has to do a full run, just all the way back here. Commandante. I prefer Commandante, sir. Alright, so there's gonna probably be a bunch of them rushing here. We still have a lot of grenades, you know. And we also have a rookie to sacrifice. That's the best part. Alright, and this, this guy's so fucked, by the way. <laughs> They're gonna take, take shots in, in a line, you know. There you go, he's gone. And there's another one right there. Now, we're fortunate because they're still not very close to that. So I'm going to just move the sniper all the way back. Yeah. Okay, you're here. Well, we know you're there, but whatever. Okay, where's my gunner? This is my gunner. So I can, I can take a shot at him, but I'd rather not. I, that's what the rest of the people are for. Alright, let's see. I have a nice scatter laser here. He's he's probably he's, he's gonna be just overwatching in case they actually do come up here, uh, which is highly unlikely. This rocketeer doesn't actually have enough movement to basically do anything good, so she's just gonna move all the way back. The same thing with the, the rookie, actually. I'm on the move. But this guy can take a shot at somebody. So he can either take a shot at that or that. Let's get the weaker one, actually. Well, maybe I shouldn't have done that because then, uh, whatever. He's fucking dead. I think I shouldn't have done that because I won't go down without a fight. <laughs> he's still doing that every time. All right, we're gonna get an Overwatch one. Let's go get a some people closer. He's not close enough to kill us anyway, so and we also we have Overwatches up the balls, so ah, that one might get us though. Oh, there's two there. Okay, so now there's three. So, since we have four turns, we actually might spend a turn here. Okay, apparently Overwatch didn't trigger, and neither did Close Combat Specialist. We could spend a turn here killing them, because we have four turns to basically get the fuck out, but... I don't know. Question is, do I care? One. That airstrike is closing in your position. You need to get to the evac point before it's too late. I mean, the sniper can do this in one move. Target confirmed. So you might as well. I, I think I think the people we do have here are more than enough I'm to handle it. So. I mean, if this guy can kill the chrysalid and, and so can the shotgunner, then... Well, uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to maybe give this one to the My rookie. No one cares if your weapon's dry. Where's, where's my rookie? Ah. Uh, let's, let's see who else we got. Ah, uh, we got this engineer. The engineer can maybe take it. I want the engineer to level up too. Alright, and... Yep, just gonna sprint these guys now. Understood. Moving out. Okay, and but but Daryl, we'll go there, and he's gonna just go right here once again. Close combat specialist and Overwatch. We know we're gonna continue mission. Best in the next move, we can all we can bring us all out. So it's pretty much at this point. It's if we want to get more experience or something, but I think we've gotten enough out of this to be honest. I'm on my way. Heading to that 
that location. On my way. I like this mission a lot. Aye, aye, Commander. I think we're ready for Sky Ranger. Ah, we're done. Nice, straightforward, and easy. Not particularly challenging, especially when you're up to like laser mech tech, but you know. It's fun all the same. The aliens would put up more of a fight. They didn't look so tough this time around. <laughs> like a, z a zillion chrysalids. Alright, we can either. Oh, let's get another assault. Um, we need assault, so that's good that we got another one. Oh, and here we go. We can now get um, um, arc, arc bonuses with him. And the Sentinel Overwatch. Nice. So I think we're going to work on making a, yet another infantry. So, so then we have like three. Just kind of how, like, how I have three snipers. I now have like. Going to have like three Remember. infantry. Uh, we got a bunch of money, um, so I, I I think I'm sold on the on, I'm sold on the mechs. Um, and who shall I make into another mech? I want to make an engineer into a mech, but however I realized I was making two support um, engineers, and so I think one of them I'd like I prefer to bring make into yeah I'm gonna bring uh, guess what um, voodoo squishy. Voodoo Squishy is going to become a mech. He's going to become an engineer mech. Uh, so let's see. Uh, so let's add him. Once the required amputations have been completed, the engineering team will begin grafting the cybersuit interfaces onto the volunteer's remaining bone structure. Uh, we can try making maybe a scout one too. Uh, you know, let me look up what the actual bonuses are. One second. Okay, so I looked it up a little bit, and it looks like that the the mech classes are relatively reminiscent of what, um, what they're already kind of have. So I think I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get maybe Chemo, who is an, a budding infantry, to become a mech. Um, I don't know how much I want to level them up before I make them into mechs, but yeah, Chemo, Chemo, you're becoming a mech. Hope you're happy. So, the things I don't think I really want to do is maybe, um, I, I don't know, the, the support one didn't look that particularly interesting. I, I might actually try and make a mech version of everything, just to kind of fuck around with it and level them up, but yeah. Uh, this is the only other one I really want to try. We'll begin fitting the cybersuit interface modules as soon as the necessary limbs have been removed. Okay. Um, that seems really mean. Alright, I think we're done because we're running out of belt now, so... We're gonna just, I think, spin the globe. You want flight computers? No, because I think I still need those. I'm pretty sure I do, actually. Shit and plating is complete. Nice. And Canada high, so he's searching for. Uh, apparently, I all only have avalanche missiles here. Did I fucking make? I thought I was making laser weapons. Did I not watch them finish up or something? Yes, I didn't watch them finish up. Alright, so I opted to go back and um, with my save and actually go uh, arm them, but it's going to take them seven days. Also, this raven needs a nickname. Pops Arnold? Sure, that, that works for me. I actually may not be able to shoot down anyways. Uh, and now they want different rewards, so no. So things have changed somewhat, but I, I figured I should go back and actually try and put the, the things on. Two scientists for a delirium, I will take that. That's very low amount of resources. We got our plating now. Yeah, just what I thought. And they're still arming for six days, so we'll try it again. Um, well, not again, but we're in pursuit. Whatever. Approaching Charlie's now. Come on, shoot us down. Well, he did a good amount of hits, but I don't think it's gonna be enough. This asshole's kind of tanky. He's scanning for size, he's probably gonna shoot one down. I'm kinda mad now. Enemy is I didn't have that ready. I don't know when I have actually completed the laser cannons though. Oh wait, you might get it. Okay. Well, we can't get him. We win some, you lose some. You didn't shoot one down, so that's okay. Alright, we got that one. Tactical sensors complete. We're not gonna have a we're not gonna have a connect strike module, unfortunately, but we will have a covert operative mission. Full one too. With discretion. 
I wonder, is he actually ready to go? Or is he kind of like, oh, he's still fatigued, that's okay. Because we have, we have two more coming, so I'm going to still bring him along. I don't give a shit. That sounds fun. fun as hell. Actually, I'm going to look at one more thing before we continue. Officer promotions. Can we make people into majors yet? I have no idea what you need to do to make them into majors. I think they just need more experience. That's likely what it is. Uh, I did make um, my infantry into one, as I mentioned. So... Uh, I, I think the infantry and the snipers will always be officers. That's how it's going to work. But anyways, that's it. So remember, we'll be watching. <laughs>